Guys who day three of war in the abyss then. Um so so we draft Duke. <clears throat> so day three obviously is research. Um obviously there should have been a lot of planning done pre this. Um obviously the higher you get up battle research and stuff like that, the, the, the longer sort of researches you can get as a rule of thumb the longer the research takes the more resources it costs the more points you're going to get for it today okay so what do we get today where again if you buy boxes if you buy, spend your money to buy the boxes you'll get points as always um so you increase tack power by one point you get up to 36 points and you increase 1.3 meteorite lab you get 50 okay so meteorite rob is worth more um but you don't get as long a re you don't get as long as research in it um i think the max is four and a half days or something like that for for any of the um level 25 um combat speed ones i'll show you that in a second um obviously i don't want to collect anything let me just let me just whack my buff on because my research is actually completed there overnight so I don't want to accidentally pick something up because sometimes just when you see stuff lit up and you've been playing so long you just automatically collect it without thinking um so yeah come on right we're on the boat a few technical issues this morning by the looks of things um let's hope that didn't stop my recording no, it doesn't seem to have. Right. So again then, obviously tying stuff up with Witta. I haven't been absolutely perfect today like I was yesterday. Um, I have one Matrix here. Um, I like to have uh, Astral Essence in here as well. And then if I can, speed up for research. Um, we have plenty of time here anyway. Um, so yeah. So hopefully I get an Astral Essence in there as well. So we, we, we've got our buff on, so let's go. Um, so obviously we have finished our research there, so we'll collect it. Again, like I said, yeah, I done T9s last week. So this is pretty low level research I'm doing now, so we didn't get a whole lot there. But I mean, if you had like T9s there, you'd be on like fucking... F um, we were actually debating it last night. So when you guys think it's down to 400, we got 500 when we did our first one. I'm fairly sure I got 460 last week. But again, that will depend on your research that you have done for Widow as well. Because um, obviously, like I said to you before, and I, I'll say it today again, if you don't have this to 100%, do it now. Okay, so all these here actually give you points, extra points, you know what I mean? For doing the stuff you're doing, so gathering, research, whatever else. And then it opens up your boxes and then gives you double rewards as well for the boxes. So you, you want this up as far as you can get it, okay? Um, probably if you're under 60 mil, the six boxes is enough because you're probably not going to get it, ever get much more than that. Um, um, but yeah, you, you, you want to keep that research going and you want to and you want to max it out as soon as possible, guys, okay? So obviously I'm going to have to speed up the meteorite lab because I've got my timing slightly wrong, but that's fine. We have, we have plenty of speed ups. Well, we don't have plenty of speed ups, but yeah. So you'll see obviously the meteorite lab there. You get more points for it, and now we're up to box eight already with just 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 from the stuff that I had pre-arranged for this event, you know, so this is not doing anything today. This is stuff I done five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten days ago or whatever. Okay. Um. Right. So we have our we have our Perseus as well. So look, that was my last probability cube there for for tanks. So my mains my main at the minute is infantry, and I'm going to be switching to the tanks for making the new tank parts. Um, and really there's no only reason apart from tanks are quicker and um, B I like the new tank titan and that's really it and I don't like the new infantry titan so <laughs> that, that's how sad things can be in this game too um, yeah when you've played it as long as me things like oh, I don't like the look of that actually lead what you do in the game so anyway let, let's stick let's stick another analysis on here Okay, so that's that started. Um, again, now we're obviously starting into artillery. I'm not that bothered about artillery. I haven't even completed the new celestial parts for tank yet, and then I will, I will do infantry, even though I don't like it after that. Um, yeah, okay. But you may as well keep doing it. You're going to get points for it, and you need to do it at some stage. Also, when you finally max this out, you're going to save a load of origin, because you don't have to use origin to make matrix, matrixes anymore. Okay, so... 
So met my wee, um, oh look, I got another one. Um, that's a shame. If that had been after lessons, that would have been perfect. So we'll just we'll bend that because um, I'm not going to do, I'm not going to do, actually, you know what, I'm going to keep that because if my research doesn't go well, see, now I'm in a catch-22 situation because I could have sped up that other matrix. And so it's just knowing what you can do to get right today. So I could, I mean, it's two two days and 13 hours. <laughs> and speed-ups don't help a lot, so your mates can't assist the, the speed-up meteorite lab, so you kind of know that's what you're going to have to do anyway. Um, so let's see, I'll do, I'll do another couple of things and then we'll have a look in Perseus and see, why did that not start? And see if, um, and see if there's an Astral Essence one just to help with the research and then obviously a research one for, um, if you don't know today actually too, let's have a wee look at what's on just before I finish that, okay? Again, use the calendar. So it shows you everything that you're on. So we're in the best we're doing anyway. Crucible of Chance I showed you yesterday. Easter event I showed you as well. We'll have a look at that now in a second actually and see if the new ones have opened because I don't actually know myself. And Parasurgeon, this is a frog one. Perseus Pursuit recovered loads. Catastrophic Torrents. I will get on to the guys today and see if we can have a go at that tonight. Um, in the round when we're doing Hydra. The only problem is we're going through gate into zone three now. So any of you that don't know, we took the gate last night at reset. And we have a couple of hours left and then we can go into a new zone and the exciting news there is come on hold um obviously we have new people coming into that area too and then we, we get to fight them um anybody that was here last season will know how exciting zone three zone three and zone four are um you'll get loads of honor points and stuff there as well um so if you're if you're looking for honor this one again remember you can spend the honor points there's loads of good stuff in there okay event center Back to my calendar. Yeah, so where are we there? I'll, I'll, so I'll try to get that going. Oh, we have training guru on at the minute too, and it last two days. So it's pretty, um, it, it's not going to fall in with Friday for troop training day, unfortunately. But look, again, you get doomsdays. The ranking rewards probably are pretty decent in it. Yeah, but again, look, they're okay. Again, have a look. See what you think. See if it's worth popping a couple of your troops before Friday. Um, that'll again depend on what resources you have to train them, what speed ups you have to speed those up. Um, Lord Torn from BDO is already on 660,000. Um, Annex from the NWO is probably the highest one from Server 5 there. And then Ted's the one. <sighs> Dean from Boy. It's only one of our guys there in that sort of top top 20 anyway. Um, Again, uh, our guys are well trained in Witta, so we'll have loads of troops training, especially if they've mass upgrade like I showed you the other day, ready to pop for Friday. So sometimes these events fall in and, and you've got to make the decision, do I want these gifts or do I want to wait for Friday to pop my to pop my trainers so I get um, better Witta points. I would suggest looking at those, unless you're doing daily training, you haven't got mass upgrade and you're training every day anyway, I would probably wait for Friday. Okay, um, you could pop one of them if you're like me and you've and you've three going and they're days long. Maybe pop one that would probably get you all the all the points in training guru, um, and put you up a wee bit. You know, to get more. So it's up to you. you. So sometimes you have to just look about and see. Right, oh, the reason why I was showing that when I was in the middle of the thing was. Okay, what else have we got? A couple of things coming up. Okay, no problem. Right, so crucible of chance. If you don't know. You want to max as many, <laughs> all the free stuff on this as you can, right? So you do it for rallies, you do it for Astra, trading at the Galactic Harbor, you see, okay? So you want to make sure that you, if stuff is like, say you've got a pink beacon in there and it's for Palak, you think, oh, right, oh, I'd like that. We'll buy it today because it's giving you a double dunter here too because it's going to give you these and then obviously gathering resources as well. So remember in the egg one, they changed it where you don't, you know, there's four things you can do, but you don't have to do all four. You just do, you can do one, you can just gather and you get the 100 eggs. This one's different, you have to do all four, you only get the max from each one, okay? And if you max this every day, you will get a go in the middle. Um, pretty much guaranteed you'll get a go in the middle, okay? If you max those free ones out every day. Um, I done three spins in the outer and then I got into the middle, okay? So I'm waiting on 100 now to get one in the middle. Um, the only time you're not going to get into, sorry, the second row, and the second row, if you don't hit it in sort of the first one or two, you're you're probably not going to get a, a go at the middle. 
But what I seem to find is on the last day of this, you, you basically every hit puts you in to the next level. Again, I don't know if that's true. It just seems to work for me. Okay. I wanted to show you that. Um, right. So back to, I'll just, I'll finish my intergalactic harbor here. Um, so we were pretty high up. So we should be fine just by doing what I normally do. But again, you want to make sure that you you have enough you have enough goals today and trading in the Galactic Harbor to max out those cubes. Okay. Um again look the only one I pay talk for is research. I won't be buying these because I don't need them. Um and again, all your origin. Always all your origin and always three three pulls, okay? And then a biomatrixes. Um, that's that's not only saving your origin, like seventy percent discount. Now that's saving your origin and time. Okay, I know you look at it and go, it's only a hundred, but if it's, say you're getting two hundred every time you do the the harbor, you have three harbors a day. There's six hundred over ten days. That's six thousand. Do you know that's a lot of flipping? Because you know how long it takes to build these. Um, they they you know they're long and they take a lot of origin. You know so. Yeah. Um. So that's why I buy them. Just, just if you need, if you need a reason. So, let's go back into Perseus and see. Oh, we've popped a few. Is there any? Right, there's a pink astral essence. So I'm just going to take that anyway. Because we may as well. So look, keep getting space matrices. You look, it is, it is sometimes fairly um, nice to you that it does recycle the ones in yours on the day. Um, Look, if you're in here, there's probably, look, dispersion fiber, fiber. If you have your, what T-frames you have to max, you're going to have loads. Um, go in and, and buy that and go in and buy the boxes for Toxic and T-frame. I'll show you what I mean by that in a second here. Or again, the orange T-frame part upgrade. Again, I'll show you that in a second. Just wanted, just wanted to spit it. Uh, by the way, guys, you just can't do this. You have to have a title to delete those off, okay? Um, you can only do the first two of your own, unless you've got a title, and then you can delete them off. But by all means, shout. If, if there's a load of blue in here and there's nothing you want, just shout out, and one of the titles will take the blues out for you. Okay? Um, right, what was I saying there? T-frame, right, again. So into the shop here. Right, so like I said, I only ever do the free one here, like I didn't get any today, but like you can buy these and you can buy these and they, what these boxes are are a chance to get all that stuff there. So they're really good now because they only give you the, the big T-frame parts and the, the, t the orange T-frame upgrades. All right, so if you go into Perseus, this is a handy one. If you've all your T-frames done, this is handy. There is another one where it's actually to buy the boxes and it's worth more than the consumption one. Okay, so if you see the one to buy the boxes, it's not there. Um, <coughs> but you'll know it if you look at it. So you could click on that, right? That says 40,000 dispersion fibers. So if you take it, you go in here, you go to your, you go to the store, you click on the boxes, right? And then you just scroll it across to 40. There you go. So it's 45,000, right? If I bought them boxes now, that would complete that Perseus task for me. Plus I have six goes at all this nice stuff here. Okay, now again, you're only going to be able to do that when you've, you've upgraded all your T-frames. The T-frame themselves, okay. <coughs> so let me just show you what I mean by that. I mean, you should all know this. I've done, I've done videos on this years ago. So, yeah. So, down here, this is what I mean. So, when, when you've maxed all these on all the Titans that you have, then you'll have spur dispersion fibre, okay. Up until you do that, you won't have spur dispersion fibre. Right, so what am I researching at the minute? Again, everybody's going to be different here. Everybody's different. Look, we could ask five different people in the alliance and five different people would tell you what's more important in battle. Run of the mill is, if you're going for T9s, obviously you need to do your battle all the way down to the bottom because you don't get them until you get to the bottom, okay? That gives you T9 troops, right? The problem then with T9 troops is they are really fucking expensive, right? So we have this, which is called pre-enhancement. And what this does is make them cheaper to train, cheaper to heal, and cheaper, cheaper to reassemble. It also gives them bonuses. So like it bonuses to attack, bonuses to defend, and stuff like that. Okay, so again, this is fairly active flipping 
look at that look at that last one there for talks like that's 109 days okay you could take 33 34 days off that with alliance assists but yeah you're, you're still on two months um so when you're down to that the only other good thing is you, you probably have good speed ups you know if you're down to that level you're doing well in advance you have speed ups you can probably speed them up quite quickly so what am i going to do today so the first thing i'm going to do is and this is the being of my freaking life right because you're making these celestial parts and up until like i said the other day you get two golds and four oranges on your titan it's not as strong as the one you're ripping apart from the old parts to fight until you did this until you get the research this this is where all the power comes from in the new parts now well obviously if you get them the gold as well they're stronger you know but yes but this is the extra bit that makes the new parts stronger you can upgrade all the parts okay to give you more attack and defense and all that but you need bloody fusion after right <coughs> we've been having a debate about this last season i'm 100 percent sure from level seven nymphs up it give you it this time it it's not on the sevens anyway we're, we're no higher than that yet so i would like to hope it comes in again very flipping soon because it's the bane of my life because you have to pay for it and i don't like games that have something that you can only get by paying for um yeah it, it makes it unfair yes i don't care if i'm free to pay and i'll take longer to get there that's fine as long as i can get there but at the minute the only way to get astral fusion is basically by paying for it with real money which is a is, is a major bugbear of mine okay so again then obviously right well it'll depend on but the best way to do right so chip is the first one engine detector blah 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 right so when you go to those parts if you're if you're clued in and you, and you can right try to try to make those parts first so you're getting the extra benefit while you do the research but again, we're going to struggle if, if nymphs don't start giving astral fusion essence. We're, we're going to struggle. We're going to struggle to do this as free to pay players. Okay. Um, so let's see. So this is basically just what I do on, a, on, on the day that we're doing research. Okay. So top up. Okay. Hit the research. Hit assist. Now you can hang about, but this is luck. This is wild early morning. And there is one other person all apart from me. So I'm not going to get any assists anyway. So what's the point in waiting? So we just speed it up, and then obviously you'll see all my research. Um, so today I would recommend if you're having a go at this and you're having a go at it for the first time, the guys that do this will know how well they're going to be able to compete. But I, I heard the guys already last night. I mean, one of the one of the lands is about five or six other guys must have popped T nines today because they're already over four hundred thousand, and they were last night at reset um so our advice today would probably be just get your nine boxes and save your stuff for the next time okay so i'm on eight at the minute but you'll find that the, the last box is, is double what you've already done so i'd have to do the same again as what i've done this morning to get the ninth box okay so ninth box might be out of my reach today because again i used a lot of my speed ups yesterday on parts and said i wouldn't gamble and did gamble three golds and one orange and got flipping orange and one of the new parts so yes nearly rage quit the game yesterday as well but anyway shit happens right so back in again i, I mean i do uh, wh whatever this i can do so whatever i have astral lessons for i will do okay i mean but you're talking a thousand astral lessons even for level one on this and if you have to bet that that's that's really going to annoy me it's really really going to annoy me because i don't like that i don't like stuff that that, that you have to buy um don't get me wrong if i want something or bad but don't tell me i have to bet to get ahead do you know what i mean you know make it free to pay as well make some avenue for it so i'll keep you up to date on that hopefully level eights might have some I was 100% sure I was telling everybody to hold off on their level 7s because they were coming out. Or not to do level 6s yesterday because the level 7s were coming out. And lo and behold, they come out no flipping astral fusion or fusion essence. This one is the sort of bubbly looking one. Um, so yeah. So not happy about that. But anyway. Oh, we haven't finished the roll. Sorry. Sorry. So where are we now? Right. Um, again, that, so I'll just go ahead with this and keep picking out bits. We'll have our Perseus now too for the pink one. Oh, oh, sorry, no, it's, it's normal last lessons for that one I picked. 
that fusion essence but i mean i'm going to do long more here so that's basically it this day is a lot about what you do a week before um at least a week before so after i finish today if i don't have a seven day research well i'll probably need a 10 or 11 day research but by the time i get the assist i will research for a couple of days until i get to the time frame that i know it's going to pop today okay and same again i'm kind of stuck with me my, my analysis because yeah I'm, I'm back you know i'm back down to to this one okay um look i can start i could start there's nothing to stop me starting the the this the combat speed of this but again it's down to four hours at the minute so i mean i could i could pop a bit of that today as well and i probably will if i'm going to get close to the nine boxes i'll, I'll probably do meteorite lab um okay so that, that's pretty much it guys again it's, it's more about the week before for research um than it is about on the day and again you can you can pick it all up pretty quickly there just just keep an eye on your timer if you're doing more research again then we do hydra and a few other things tonight where we'll have loads of people on and you can pop a couple of quick handy researches if you're low level um just with assists you know you, you could get three or four small level ones done tonight in that in that 30 minutes in that hour all right guys hope it helps talk to you soon